Hello, everyone. Thanks for joining us on this Wednesday, and welcome to this educational presentation where today I want to talk to you about the secret to catching a big move. Now, we've seen what's happened today in the markets. As of late, I just saw before I began, the market was down roughly about 800 points. So that's a big move to the downside. We've also had big moves to the upside. What if I told you that there was a secret process that you could apply every day for any market in order to catch these big moves? For example, let's look at this chart here. As you look at DXCM, it appears that sure, it's going up, but there's no real clue just looking at three bars here that anything is going to happen for all you know, intents and purposes. We could quickly go straight up or quickly go straight down. But what if I told you through this secret process that you would have generated a buy signal right here and potentially been able to capture upwards of 100 points in the next couple of weeks? Now, as the market kind of topped out and started to phase downwards, you wouldn't have done anything until right here when the same secret process would have generated a sell signal. And potentially you could have captured upwards of 135 points to the downside. So this is what we're going to be talking about today. And this is what I'll reveal the secret to catching a big move. And it's really simple because you can apply it on our platform. Everything is one click away. So welcome once again. My name is Stephen Primo. I am the president and founder of Specialist Trading. Thank you for joining us today. This promises to be a great educational presentation because I'm going to show you how simple it is to actually catch these big moves. Now, I've been trading big moves just about all of my trading career. I started 45 years ago on the floor of the Pacific Stock Exchange. I was on the trading floor for 16 years, and nine of those years I was a specialist. So that's where we get the name Specialist Trading. I know a lot of people that are new to my webinars think, well, what is so special about this guy? Why does he call himself specialist? <laughs> well, it's just the title. Those traders that you ever Google and look at the uh, trading floors in the uh, 40s and 50s where they had a bunch of people yelling and screaming and there was paper all over the floor. Uh, those traders on the floor behind those large wooden podiums were called specialists. They specialized in making markets in roughly about 50 or 60 stocks. So I did that during the crash of 87 and the bull market that followed. And if you can think of any trading method, any trading system or strategy, anything that's supposed to be so innovative, so unique and so brand new, it's mostly been around before, most likely. And most likely I've traded it. I've traded just about every technique, method, system, uh, strategy you can think of. I've traded straight up markets, straight down markets, very volatile, big moving markets and very quiet with no movement at all. And in my 45 years, I really know what works in terms of consistency and I know what doesn't. So roughly about 13 years ago, I teamed up with Pro Trader Strategies with one goal in mind, and that was simply to educate traders around the world, all the things that actually do work, the things that have levels of consistency. And I'm happy to say we have over 100, uh, or I should say we have students in over 115 countries and in every state in the United States. So that's what we're going to try to do today, show you uh, a little bit of our education and hopefully get you on board so that you can capture these big moves. Now, before we begin, once again, as always, we are required to share this with you. So please take a moment to view our disclaimer. I'm going to show you a lot of performance results using this secret method, but please remember that we can in no way guarantee that any of the results I'm about to share with you will be repeated in the future. Also, please remember that all examples, since we are an educational company, all examples are strictly for educational purposes only. Now, another way to get uh, education on a daily basis is to follow us on Twitter. I would suggest copying down our handle right there, abbreviation for specialist trading. I post upwards of three to seven or eight different uh, snapshots of signals or trades a day that our strategies or techniques have generated. And I give little explanations as to why they were generated, what's the uh, concept behind the signals. I also post a little bit of financial wisdom as well, things to help you trade. So there's a lot of great free educational information on a daily basis. So please feel free to follow us on Twitter. Now we are different. I see a lot of new names here, people coming into today's presentation today. Uh, we are different. If you follow me for the first time from other presentations or from other webinars, in the fact that we don't predict or tell any of our students or traders around the world how to trade. In fact, that's the very basis of our philosophy of, of education. Our Philosophy is simply to provide you with the tools, techniques, and methods that have stood the test of time that really show high levels of consistency and then work with you so that you can ultimately use them on your own and make your own trading decisions. Now, a lot of people say, well, what's so important about that, Steve? Why can't you just tell me what to buy or sell? Because if there's one thing I've learned in 45 years, that doesn't work. I mean, think of it. 
you're all trained, most of you are trained, myself included, we were all trained to listen to some trading guru or to buy some $10,000 system that spits out buy and sell signals or to watch the guys on TV tell us what they think the market's going to do the next day, right? Or to wait for the earnings to tell us if they're going to be good or bad. And that's how we can make our decisions. You see, this is all based on you taking your decisions from someone or something else. The entire industry is based on that fact. It was when I first started 45 years ago, and it continues today. I mean, think about it. How many of you go to read a blog every day or you uh, wait to see what they're saying on TV or wait for the economic report to make a decision? We all seem to believe that we have to wait for something to tell us it's OK. But if that style works so well, why is it estimated that 85 percent of all traders fail? Well, obviously, it's because it doesn't work. Now, I started trading, like I said, 45 years ago, and I traded on the trading floor with hundreds of other traders, two or 300 traders in the same uh, room, the same stock exchange. Uh, there were lots of traders that made tons of money, hundreds of thousands of dollars, even millions of dollars in a short relative time. And every one of them gave that money away. They are no longer trading. In fact, there's only about two or three of those traders still trading on a daily basis. It's because they relied on someone or something else to give them their decision-making process. The only traders that are still trading are the ones that make their own trading decisions. So this is what we want to instill in all of you. We try to give you the information, give you the education, and then work with you alongside with you so that ultimately you can make your own trading decisions. That's what a good mentor does. A good mentor teaches you how to trade. And that's what I do with all my students. And hopefully I'll be able to do that with you as well. This is what we call the specialist edge. The same edge that has sustained me now going on 45 years, and hopefully it will do the same for you. Now, a few announcements before we begin today's class. This is going to be an educational class, so ask me as many questions as you'd like. But as always, I like to take my questions at the end. So please, if you have a question, wait till the very end of class. I promise I'll get to it at the very end. Okay, I have a lot of slides to share with you, and I don't want to stop for every slide. It will be here far too long on your Wednesday afternoon. Okay. Uh, the other thing is, this is being recorded. A lot of people are always saying, hey, I have to leave early or I, I can't stay for the entire presentation or I, I'm having technical issues. Don't worry, each and every one of you will be sent a link to this recording so you can watch it as often as you'd like. And then lastly, remember, this is not an interactive Zoom presentation. We're not going to share our cameras and uh, just talk uh, you know, whenever we'd like. This is a classroom. It's a static PowerPoint presentation. So please remember to disable all your microphones and cameras, okay? This is just a static PowerPoint presentation. With that said, why don't we begin today's class? And I'd like to start out with something. I always like to start with a theme, and this is what I learned trading on the floor and what my mentors taught me. And they said, Steve, it's a gambler's mindset to try and pick tops and bottoms. I mean, think about it. We're always taught to buy low and sell high, but that really is a gambling mindset because Last I saw, about half hour ago, the market was down 800 points. Now, what if when the market was down 300 points, you decided to buy just at the market, right? You think you'd be doing very well, but that's buying low, right? What if you had tried to pick a bottom when it was down 500 points? How would that have helped you, okay? That's a gambling mindset because you're trying to get the very lowest price and you're trying to get out with a big win. You're trying to hit a home run. And that's not a true professional mindset. It's a professional's mindset to trade with the trend. So when the market was down 800 points, where was the trend? It was down. So therefore, you should only be looking for selling opportunities, not buying opportunities. Remember, how well would you have done if you were trying to pick a bottom just an hour or two ago when the market was down three or 400 points? Not very well. But what if you would look for a selling opportunity? Well, you could have probably had a really nice trade to the downside with 400 points more to go on the downward uh, bias, okay? So... What we're going to be talking about today is a great tool we have at Specialist Trading, something I developed with ProTrader Strategies. We call it the PTSXT. Now, this is an indicator, all right? It's not a strategy that spits out buy and sell signals. It can indicate and highlight these high probabilities for entry, but it's simply designed to identify extreme trends in advance. This is how you capture those big moves. This is the secret indicator that is specifically designed to do that. Okay, now the way it does that without giving anything away, let me show you right here. Here's a chart of FCX, and this is a weekly chart of Freeport McMillan. Now, looking in hindsight, this is the way most traders, you know, get depressed. They say, gosh, how come I couldn't have bought that, you know, weeks in advance or months in advance? God, I would have made a killing, but how did I know? You know, I just uh, had no idea this thing was going to go up that strongly. 
Well, let me show you how powerful the PTS XT is. It's designed to paint these yellow blocks around the price bars that it determines are going to be going up in an extreme trend. Okay, so as you can see here, once it painted the block around this first bar, it continued to do so all the way up. So the simplicity of this is obviously when it's in a yellow block, you want to be a buyer because not only are you in sync with the trend, you are in sync with an extreme trend. You see, this is not just to tell you, oh, well, okay, we're in an uptrend. No, this is only uh, designed to identify a big move. And that's what the title of today's presentation is, how to capture and find those big moves. Now, this can also work to the downside. Once again, we're looking at uh, uh, A, B, and B. Obviously, it's going lower. Uh, in hindsight, we say to ourselves, how come we couldn't have sold somewhere around here? That would have been a nice sell. Well, once we apply the PTSXT, we see that it paints a red block around bars that are specifically identified as being in an extreme downtrend. So therefore, you do not want to be buying if you have a red block painted around bars. You want to be looking for a selling opportunity, okay? So this is the secret, using this tool. This is how you will capture those big moves because once again, it's only designed to find these big moves. If the market is going steadily upwards, kind of fits and starts, it's not gonna generate a yellow block or a red block. It's pretty much gonna just stay out of it. But if we have these big moves like you just saw uh, today, you're gonna to have a big, huge red block and it's gonna, all you have to do is be in sync with that trend, with that particular color. So the indicator is designed to identify these extreme trends in advance. Once again, we can't give away the rules because it's an in-house tool, but it's based on multiple proprietary indicators and their relationship to one another, how they react off each other. And lastly, it's official. The PTSXT, the secret tool, is our most popular trading tool to date. We have students using it in Europe. We have students uh, using it in the United States in uh, uh, other indices and exchanges, and currency pairs, uh, ETFs, Forex, commodities. It can be applied to any market and any time frame. And the official way to determine whether it's our most popular trading tool is because we know that now there are other websites and other uh, so-called educators copying the PTSXT. They're using the same style of painting a block around extreme trends and they just do not get the same type of results. We've looked at them and the best is the original, which ProTrader Strategies and I myself designed. Okay, so let me share with you the secret daily trade process. This is what you must do on a daily basis in order to have the best odds in your favor for capturing these big moves. Now, I'm not gonna sit here and tell you that every time you see a uh, you know red block or yellow block, you're gonna be going up 100 points. No, but uh, you have a high probability that you're really going to have the odds in your favor of a big move behind you. So here's the process I want to share with you. And remember this process only belongs to ProTrader Strategies and you can only apply it by using our platform, the PTS Primo charting platform that teaches traders how to trade. Okay, it's a simple process. Step one, at or after the close. So in other words, when we say at or after the close, what we mean is if you're able to be in front of your computer all day and you're sitting in front watching the trades, uh, possibly 10 to five minutes before the close means at the close. Or after the close means if you're not able to be in front of your computer, if you're working all day and you come home, that's just as good, just as well you can do this after the close. But on or after the close of the trading day, conduct a nightly PTSXT scan. Okay, now here's how you do that. On our platform, you see right here, this is the opening up blank page. You find in the green upper green strategy tab where all of our strategies and methods are, you find the PTSXT extreme trend right here. And just double click that green tab and you'll see this drop down menu. Go all the way to where it says scan, click on scan, and you'll see this page appear has a little title there, PTSXC Extreme Trend, and this is the scanning page. Now go to the far left and you want to load symbols. Load the symbols of whatever market you're interested in. Currency pairs, if you're interested in ETFs, or you're interested in uh, commodities, cryptos, or stocks. And if you're interested in stocks, you can create your own list or you can uh, simply pick something like the NASDAQ or the S&P. For uh, simplicity's sake, let's just uh, load our symbol list and pick the NASDAQ and it'll show you what list that you pick, okay? And you'll see this appear. And by the way, what I'm doing right now, I'm taking a long time to explain it, but this probably takes less than five seconds to do. And then you just hit scan. Once you get the uh, spreadsheet of whatever market you want, 
click on scan, and in roughly about 30 seconds, you'll see a series of uh, uh, horizontal green and horizontal red bars, okay? These are the corresponding uh, stocks that are in the extreme uptrend for green and the extreme downtrend for red. Now we go to step two. We want to select stocks to trade that have a bar count of one. So what does that mean? Well, remember, the PTSXT is going to place uh, a yellow or a red block around bars that it deems are in an extreme trend. Uh, that you can have 20 bars in that block. You can have one bar. What we're looking for are the bars that just have a count of one. How do we find that? That means that they've only been in a block for one bar. So what we want to do is come over to the far right here where it says bar count and click on that double click and it sorts it and come all the way down where it just has these one here, see? Right there. This means that it most recently were the newest bars of a stock to be in an extreme uptrend. And you could do the same thing for the downside with bars in red. So these are the ones that you're interested. In. These are the ones corresponding right here on the left that were just inside their first bar in a green, uh, or I should say yellow uh, bar. So now you can go through and click on and look at all these charts to see which of these, if any, interest you. And so we go to step three, which is simply to trade. That's it. That's how simply, uh, simple all this process is. There's nothing else you really have to do other than you know, just kind of look at it and say, okay, well, I found the ones that I'm interested in, and then I'm just going to simply trade them. Let me show you what I mean here. Let's go through this process very simply and easily. All right, we're looking at FTNT. All right, not much indication here. Sure, it's going up, but maybe we think it's up a little bit too much. I don't want to buy that high. Maybe I think it, uh, you know, uh, there's some bad news coming out with the earnings. But remember, we don't listen to any of that outside information. We just listen to what the stock is telling us. So if we click on the PTSXT and we see that we did a scan and this was the very first time it was in a yellow block. Now, if this is going to be a really big move, if this is going to take off, obviously it stands to reason that this is the bar you want to get in on, right? The very first one, because most likely that'll be at the very bottom if it's a big move. So let's say we bought here. And remember, you can choose to buy wherever you'd like. You can buy on the close if you're in front of your computer. Let's say you got home after the close and you did a scan and you saw that this was it's number one day in the block. Well, you could buy in the opening of the next day. You could place a limit somewhere down here or maybe down lower, or it's up to you. Either way, you would have had a chance to buy anywhere you wanted to for three or four days, but then look what ultimately happened. In the next three weeks, it ultimately took off 22 points. Not a bad little run, right? There was no need to look at earnings. There was no need to listen to guys every night and find out what they like or don't like, what they think of the market. There was no need to wait for the economic numbers of the jobless claims or whatever you're looking at. Absolutely none, because it's all in the price. All right, let's look at another example right here. Looking at TCOM, uh, all right? Once again, we're going lower, but there's not really a lot of information because we're, you know, just looking at five bars or so. So how can we really tell what's going on? So basically, we're going to stay out of this, right? That guy on in the chat room I go to doesn't like this stock. So I think I'll just, uh, you know, stay on the sidelines. Well, once again, we're trained to listen to other people. Why don't we just look at our tool, the PTS XT? And as we can see, it is the first bar in a red block, okay? So obviously, what's that telling us? It's telling us that the big move to the downside hasn't even begun. If you think, think this is oversold, well, you know, uh, it's not time to buy. It has not even begun to get in. And then you decide to sell, and you could sell at the market. Let's say you were long the stock. Let's say you wanted to go short. You could buy puts at the market or wait and place a limit to buy the puts. Either way, you had a good five days or so to get short. Ultimately, in two months, the stock went down 15 points, okay? So you see how simple this is, but you see how it's designed just to capture these big moves. And with each preceding bar, if it's still telling you that you're in a down move, it will continue to paint a red block around that bar. So let's look at some recent examples. Now that you understand the simplicity behind the process, let's look at some recent examples now and how you could have applied this just about this last month. Some of these trades I'll share with you were the last uh, 30 to 60 days. Some of them were the last... Uh, about three or six days, okay? Let's look at buys first. Let's uh, look at if how you could have taken advantage of some big up moves. Now, obviously we know that the market has been going down for almost two months now. 
So the buys uh, are not that big. There will be some, but there weren't a lot of, uh, you know, uh, really nice upward signals. When we go in to look at sales, you'll see how you really could have taken advantage of this because obviously it's going in sync with the trend. But for buys right now, we see that, remember, we're going to apply this with the PTS Primo charting platform because this is the only place you can apply this secret process. You can't do it you know, just on any other platform. You need uh, our platform to do a nightly scan and you need to be able to have the PTS XT Extreme Trend Indicator. Okay, let's look at RDBX, all right? Not much information. We kind of see just looking off of three or four bars here, there's nothing really to tell us. So most traders would say, how can you make a trade or make a decision based off three bars? Well, that's the beauty of the PTS XT because once we apply that, we simply click it on on our platform, click on the scan, and then we would have seen overnight that that was the first bar. So we could have bought on the close. We could have placed a limit, but either way, the stock went up eight points coming into the first week of May, a couple of weeks ago. Now, I know a lot of you say, well, eight points, Steve. I thought this was about big moves. That's not a big move. Well, look at the price of the stock. I mean, basically, we're looking at a $3 stock, a 2 or $3 stock. So eight points represents basically a 250% price gain in just one week. Now, think if you had IBM or Tesla, and it gained 250% in one week. All right, so it's all relative. Let's look at this example in SIMO, all right? Someone looking at this would say, well, yeah, obviously we are in an uptrend as you can see, but that chat room I go to on a daily basis says that this is tremendously overbought. I mean, look at this reversal. It went up higher and then closed towards the low. I don't really like this. I'm thinking of selling it, all right? This is the way we make our decisions based off of what someone or something else is telling us. But what is the PTS XT saying, which is based on market behavior and nothing else? Well, this, even though you may have thought this was overbought, it was generating the very first yellow block around the bar. So where you were thinking of selling, it was saying, no, now is the time to buy. The stock went up 12 points in the next week, okay? Here's an example in SMCI. One bar, all we need is one bar because you guessed it, that one bar had a yellow block around it. You could have decided to purchase that day or the opening of the next day, 13 points. Now this took a little bit of time, but as you notice, it didn't do anything for a week or so. And it basically went sideways to lower, but the entire time it went sideways to lower, what was the color of the block? It was yellow. It continued to paint a yellow block. So you could have purchased more. A lot of our students say, listen, I only trade in the blocks. If price, once price goes out of the block, I'm not even trading anymore. So you can do that as well. But look how it ultimately went up, most likely based on some news a couple of weeks ago. But this has no requirement of news at all in its calculation. Now, speaking of news, let's look at what Yahoo reported on April 4th. This was about a month ago. OK, Twitter shares close up on 20 uh, up 27 percent after Musk takes a 9 percent state. OK, obviously, we've all heard of this. Uh, Elon Musk wanted to uh, get a greater hold on uh, uh, Twitter earlier uh, in the month. And at that time, no one knew anything about what was going on. And then the news came out and the stock shot up 27%. This was on April 4th, okay? As we look at the actual chart of the stock, we see that here's where the news came out. And the next day it went up higher after everyone heard about it and it closed lower, okay? So this is the way most traders trade. They'll wait for once again an outside source to tell them, hey, that's good news. I better buy or better sell depending on the news bias. And usually what will happen is they see this news, so they buy on the opening and look what happens. It closes lower and we've all seen it's gone much lower after that. What if we could have purchased Twitter well before the news came out right here, right? But most traders would say, well, how would you have into any indication unless you were, you know, had uh, some source of advanced information to this news because no one knew he was interested in doing this. Well, remember, we never based any of our methods based off news because the market is always telling us what it wants to do in advance. So why would we have to wait for news? Once again, that's why most traders fail. If you learn how to listen to the market by applying the PTSXT, you would have seen that it generated a buy signal weeks in advance, okay? Well in advance of that news, right here. And even though it didn't do anything much, much for the next two weeks, you had plenty of time to buy before that news came out. And ultimately, you could have potentially captured 18 points in a little over a couple of weeks, okay? So once again, if you feel you need to rely on any news source to make a decision, please feel free to go ahead. Is it in any way a requirement to become a consistent trader? In our opinion, not at all. In fact, I stopped looking at news 45 years ago. 
over four decades ago. I have not looked at any use for my personal trading and I continue not to because why would I need to? So if you really feel that you need to, by all means, go ahead, but why overcomplicate your trading when it's our opinion that there's no need to do that? All right, let's look at Amgen, okay? Once again, we're looking at just a small sample size of three bars. How can you make a decision based off that, right? Well, if we apply the PTSXT, it generated a yellow block around this third bar. You could have purchased on the close the next day, wherever you wanted to with a lower limit. Either way, 23 points. Now, as you can see, once it left the yellow block, well, a lot of our traders like to avoid trading altogether. They say, well, you know what? I'm out of the trade. I'm no longer going to trade Amgen until it goes back into a yellow or a red block. Here's an example in REGN, Regeneron. It appears as if it started to go up, but not a lot of information. A yellow block happened right here. Uh, and look what happened, 105 points in the next three to four weeks. Remember, as we say, the reason why you want to do that secret process of the scan that you'll only find on our platform is because it's the very first bar. If it is going to be a, a really extreme move, that's the bar that you want to get in on. That's how to catch a big trend. Now, we showed you at the very beginning, the very onset of today's presentation, where you could have purchased and potentially made 100, you could have sold and potentially captured 135 points. How could you have done that? Well, let me show you. Once you applied the PTSXT, the first yellow bar, if you would have done a scan, was right here, and you could have potentially captured 100 points. Right here, you would be out of trading. And then, once again, a sell signal was generated off this first block because it had a red bl uh, block around that bar, and you could have potentially captured 135 points, okay? Now, I know a lot of you, as I always say, always get uh, emails saying, well, Steve, the only way I could capture 235 points is if I bought here at the very close and exited at the top and then sold here at the very close and then exited right at the very bottom, okay? Now, it's very difficult to do, right? Sure, you're right. But we're just saying that's how much you had to work with. Let's say you only made half of that, okay? Let's say you only made half of that, it captured half. That's still 117 points, okay? Would you be happy with 117 points in a couple of months? I think so. Let's say you only made half of that, okay? Well, would you be happy with roughly 59 points? I think so. 59 points in just a, a couple of uh, months or a month or two? That's not a bad little uh, capture of a trade, okay? So remember, we're just telling you the potential of what you could have captured. All right, now let's look at some other moves here. These are big moves to the downside. Let's look at the sells you could have taken advantage of this past month or a couple of weeks ago. Here's an example in VRSK. Obviously, it's going lower. Most traders would say, gosh, you know, I don't know if I want to sell here. This is where I've always been trained to buy, right? You want to buy low, sell high. But once again, what was the theme of today's presentation? It's a gambler's mindset to want to pick tops and bottoms. It's a professional mindset to go with the flow, to go with the trend. And right now, the PTSXT is telling us that an extreme trend is most likely going to begin right now. So this is the bar you want to get in on, doing that uh, secret scan. You could have sold that night and potentially captured 30 points, okay, coming into last week, just a little less than a week ago. Here's another example in VRSN, all right? It's been coming lower, but it looks like it wants to stop. In fact, that $10,000 course you took on the support and resistance levels where the institutions are buying and selling, uh, that they have this secret indicator that tells you where the bottom is, that's generating a big buy signal here, right? Once again, I used to trade with the institutions who generated these support and resistance levels, and they had the worst track record of any traders that used to enter orders in my book. So I wouldn't, I wouldn't risk a dime on what the institutions are doing. So even if that course you took says, well, you have to follow support and resistance. Remember, support and resistance, we only teach things that I've, in my 45 years, have shown high levels of consistency, and I have never found any consistency in support and resistance in that type of uh, concept because it's too subjective. How many times have you seen and you thought something was support and someone else no, that says, no, that's resistance, or no, that's not support, it's support is much lower. You want things that are cut and dry, like having a yellow block, or I should say a red block around the bar. There's no room for questioning. It's determining that you're going much lower. Now, nothing much happened four days after that, but look what happened ultimately. It kicked in and what happened to the support, okay? Now we're down 45 points coming into last week once again. As we look at uh, WDA, Workday, 
Same things, we're coming lower, we seem to be stopping here, but a cell uh, red block was painted around this bar. Gave you plenty of time to get in if you wanted to go short, because for the next three or four days, we just kind of oscillated below, up, above, below, up, above. But last week, we would have been down 60 points from that very first bar. That's why it's so important to run that secret scan, because you'll know the bars that have the very first uh, 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 bar in the red or the yellow block. Here's an example in team, okay? Well, we're going lower, but not, not nothing that scary to write home about. It looks like we could go higher maybe, but there's a red block painted around this bar. And look what happens. 110 points coming into, once again, this week. Now, here's another example of, it appears that maybe the market is stopping and you want to buy for all intents and purposes. If you ever looked at candlesticks, this is a bullish engulfing pattern. That is very extremely bullish, right? So how can you look to sell here when you should be actually buying and you actually say to yourself, maybe I should buy, but let me check the PTSXT. And the PTSXT has been in a red block for the last week. So you should actually should have already been short. Don't worry about you know, candlesticks. Don't worry about support and resistance. Don't worry about earnings. Don't worry about news about buyouts. The market tells you in advance, just the same way here with IDXX has told us in advance, prior to a drop of 165 points coming into last week. And then lastly, we look at this chart here in Netflix, okay? Obviously we're going straight down, okay? But once again, we have a bullish engulfing pattern right here. That's the perfect uh, uh, chart example, an ideal example of you wanting to buy at the bottom of a trend because a, a uh, engul engulfing pattern is a reversal pattern. And on top of that, it may be oversold. So that guy in the chat room is saying, you have to buy this. Netflix is down way too low. Now, this was uh, coming into May, but a red block was painted at the beginning of May, well before you know, it could have been oversold or well before a bullish engulfing pattern was painted there. And we all know what happened in the next month with uh, Netflix, down 190 points. Now, this was obviously off some news once again, how did we know it was going to gap down like that? There's no reason that we need to look at anything fundamental of what's going to be announced by the company because the, uh, the uh, PTSXT was already telling us this is in an extreme downtrend mode. There's nothing else we really needed to know. All right. Uh, lastly, Melly, we're looking at this now. It looks like we're kind of going, we hit some type of a bottom. In fact, this could be institutional buying, right? Okay, we're kind of hitting a double bottom here. We have another bullish engulfing pattern. It looks like we're hitting some support. You got to buy this, right? Well, what does the PTSXT say? Nope. In fact, at the very top, it already told us weeks ago, you should be short and continue to be short. Even though you have a bullish engulfing pattern here, even though there may be so-called support, we are still in the red block. That's all that matters. And then look what happened. Potentially could have captured 440 points, okay? Now, just to show you that this works on other markets and other time frames, I know not everyone trades stocks. Here's an example, a weekly chart of DKNG, DraftKings. Same process applies if we're looking at a weekly time frame. We just scan the weekly bars. We can do that on our platform. And there was a sell signal generated here coming into this year down nearly 30 points. How about if you trade currency pairs? All right, here is an amazing uh, setup that's happened recently, just in the last month in uh, the dollar yen, all right? Same process applies with currency pairs. All you have to do is uh, load the symbols for the currency pairs. You would have seen that a yellow block was painted around this in early March, in early March, a couple of months ago. Look at the straight up move that's happened. And even when you had these sell-offs here, down, 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 we continue to be in the yellow block, kind of sideways to down market. We're still in the yellow block, okay? That was 1,500 pips in just a couple of months. Here's a chart, a 10-minute chart of the E-mini futures. Here's an older chart. As we can see, 20 potential points you could have captured to the downside. You're out of the market here. Here's the first yellow block. You're back in to the upside now and 60 potential points to the upside, okay? So you could have captured potentially 80 points, all right? But once again, you would have had to get in at the very beginning and out at the very low or out at the very top. So let's say you only made half of that. Let's say you only made 40 points, okay? Well, in the span of one day, that's still uh, $2,000 per contract. So you see there's so much potential to be made. You don't have to get in and out at the very bottom or top. 
Here's an example in bean oil, okay? 15 points, the same process, which represents thousands of dollars you could have bought on the very first uh, block bar of one and ridden it all the way up. If you're an investor, you can still use this even on longer timeframes, like a monthly chart of Costco. Here's a monthly chart going all the way back to 2018. Apply that, and we see the very first bar. These are monthly bars that appear in the yellow block. You could have bought, exited on the uh, bar outside of the block, gotten in again, exited on the bar outside, and then got back in again. This is just one way to trade it. In our course, we teach you literally dozens of ways to apply this. Four hundred and twenty five points you could have potentially captured just using the PTSXC. OK, so let's review what we've talked about today. Remember, there's a simple three step process. The secret process you can only apply by using our platform. The first thing is to conduct a nightly PTSXT scan. Remember, you can do this if you're able to be in front of your computer five minutes before the close. You can go through any list you like and in just about a minute you'll see the bars that are in the one count, meaning that these have only been in the yellow block for one bar. OK, so you want to select the stocks with a bar count of one, because if they do take off to the upside or downside, those for all intents and purposes are the bars you want to get in on. Right. You don't want to get in halfway while the, the big move has already started. Right? And you still can because we've seen how extended they can go. But if you're waiting for that big move, which is the title of today's presentation, how to how to capture a big move, well, that's where you want to get in on the bar count of one. And we tell you where that is. And then lastly, just trade. Pick whatever stock, whatever market, whatever ETF, whatever currency pair, whatever crypto that you're interested in trading. Remember our theme today. It is a gambler's mindset to try and pick tops and bottoms. Just think of it. Look at some of those last examples I shared with you where the market was going straight down like Netflix. What if you had tried to pick a bottom in Netflix? Do you think that would have worked out pretty well? That obviously the PTSXT was saying and projecting an extreme trend to the downside. So all you want to do is either get out of the way or get on board and be a seller, buy the puts or sell short the stock. But remember, a professional trades with the trend. A gambler trades against the trend. So ask yourself, do you think this indicator, the PTSXT, can help your trading for the remainder of 2022? We're getting close to the halfway mark. Are you seeing the type of results you promised yourself that you'd get at the very beginning of the year? Most likely you're not. Well, here's a great way to turn things around, okay? We have a great attendee special offer for all of you taking time out of your day today. We're gonna to offer you our trading in the express lane special. This is the PTS XT extreme trend. You're gonna get the full course. It generates these high probability zones, these blocks. And remember, you can apply it to any market and any time frame. Now, if you like, you can also trade your current strategy. That's what I said. A lot of our students like to trade their strategies with the blocks. They only uh, trade their strategies when they are in sync with the block that was just generated, okay? And you can build your own strategy based off this. Either way, it gives you the confidence to pull the trigger. But we're going to throw in a special bonus for all the people attending today. We're going to throw in new customers will receive a full year of the PTS Primo charting platform absolutely free. A full year. Uh, this is where you can run that nightly scan. This is where with one click, you can see the yellow or red blocks. But there's also a host of other things included with that. Okay, Because on a platform, which I developed with ProTrader Strategies, you have over 45 years of tips, techniques, and strategies, and techniques and methods that I've accumulated and that are on the platform as well. Okay, Things like our enhanced buy sell line, four ways to determine the overall trend, a strength of trend tool that really has an uncanny ability to tell you whether a trend is running out of steam or not. Okay, Auto-generated exit levels. These are exit, uh, 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 this is a method, an exit method, just of one of the many methods we teach in the course that are auto-generated on the platform. With one click, you can see what these levels are. Uh, it also has over 90 of the most prominent technical indicators, personalized tech support. But here is what I feel is the best thing, the scanner. Once again, because you can only run this scan looking for the bar count on the platform. And obviously that's included with this special deal. Now, let's look at just a few more things that you could have done this past week or month ago, okay? Here's an example in WMT. All right, now coming into April, Last month, we see that we were headed higher. You could have run a scan that night and seen that there was a yellow block around this, okay? So you say to yourself, you know what? I kind of like this stock. I want to take advantage of this. So maybe you bought on the close or bought on the opening of the next day.
But either way, that's your buy signal. And look, you could have taken advantage of a quick 15 points in the next couple of weeks. Not a bad little trade, right? Okay, now as price moved out, once again, you could avoid trading, take your profits and say, that's okay, I'm out of the trade. And then look what happened here. This just happened last week. You could have done another nightly scan and seen on the 10th, a sell signal was generated, all right, in Walmart. Now, that was your sell signal. You could have bought puts. You could have shorted the stock, or let's say you were still long. Well, now's the time to get out because look what happened. If you had sold, potentially you could have captured 18 points. And this was coming into this morning, okay? I believe it's down even lower today. But this just happened. Now, obviously, some news or something came out where Walmart just went straight down. Now, how did we know this five days in advance? Did they call us up and tell us that uh, Walmart's going to be down about 15 points in one day? So tell your students in the webinar to get out of it because we're, we're just giving you guys an advance notice. <laughs> no, we don't follow news. I stopped following news over four decades ago. Everything you need to know is in the chart in front of you. Now, one last example here as we look at TGT, another uh, issue that had to deal with news today. A lot of traders would say, well, this is kind of heading sideways to nowhere, Steve. In fact, once again, you know, I... I don't know, I, I can't fight that support and resistance. I, I bought that you know, $10,000 uh, indicator and I took that course and they say that you know, there's major, major support here. I don't understand why I should be selling. Well, if we apply the PTSXT, it doesn't take support and resistance into account. It doesn't take earnings into account. It doesn't take any fundamental news. It doesn't take any economic report and it doesn't take some guy on a webinar into account. It only takes into account what the market is doing. It is based solely on market behavior. And look what happened. On the ninth, a sell signal, you could have taken advantage of that, was generated. And today, it dropped 55 points in seven days. Obviously, some news came out. I have no idea what the news is in, in Target today. Why would I care? You know, it's like, <laughs> you know, who cares what the news is? If you have a profit of 55 points, that's all you're concerned about. That's great. You know, so. Once again, this just happened in the last week. This is why this offer I'm going to give all of you today is, is so extreme in itself because it's basically going to help you take your trading to the next level. The original PTSXT Extreme 10 indicator can really take your trading to the next level and really give you the type of results I think you're looking for. So here's the offer we have for today. All right, remember, everything you saw was displayed on our platform. We're going to throw that in for a full year as well. Now, normally, if we are taking advantage of this extreme ten, uh, trend special offer, it's going to cost our students roughly close to $5,000 to take the course. That's how popular and that's how powerful this is. But here's the great deal we have for you today. We're not going to charge you $5,000. A one-time payment, one-time payment of $497, and then just simply a monthly payment of $97. That's it. You can be up and running as early as today for less than $500 and then a monthly payment of 97. And that's it. And remember, this comes with a full year of the platform. Now, if you wanna pay in full, it's 44.95. You'll still save $500 and you'll still receive one year free platform if you're a new customer, okay? So take advantage of this great offer. What would normally cost you 49.95 would only cost you a one-time payment of 497 along with a 97 per month small monthly payment. That's it. And you can be up and running and taking advantage of signals as early as today, okay? This is a great offer, a great way to turn your trading around, and it's only for a limited time only. So you have to take advantage of this quickly. Here's how to take advantage of this. Contact Pro Trader Strategies. I developed a platform with them. They're in charge of all the pricing and all the discounts. I would suggest calling them on the phone at 310-598-6677. Uh, they're very flexible. They would be happy to take your order over the phone, or they'd be happy to give you some more examples or just to walk you through the process or tell you about the platform, okay? And remember, you're all going to receive a uh, recording of this so you can watch it again at your own leisure. But please do not sit on this deal because probably by next week, it will be back up to $49.95. Now, if you want more information, that link you see at the very bottom right here is the link that will take you to the info page, more information and the sign up page. Uh, but we've also posted a live link on the chat box in your uh, Zoom chat box. If you open that up, there's a live link at the very bottom. So you can click that on as well. Now, I promise you I would answer any question if you have. Uh, we have just a few minutes left for questions. So please uh, go to your chat box, type them in, and I promise I will answer them to the best of my ability, okay? 
Uh, someone is asking about uh, support. Uh, when you say support, are you talking about tech support? Because if it's tech support, uh, that's basically uh, uh, pro-trader strategies. And they have, I have to say that we have a great tech support uh, 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 department because most of the tech support uh, issues or problems are answered within that day. We've had a tremendous amount of testimonials saying, telling us how great our tech support is. So if that's what you're referring to, let me see, I think you're answering. No, you're talking, okay, you're talking about the support for trading. Well, with the support for trading is what we call educational correspondence. And every one of my students, regardless of what strategy or method or course you're taking, each and every one of them uh, get my personal email address, okay? So anytime you have a question, you're free to email me whenever you'd like, and it comes directly to me, okay? It doesn't come to uh, a salesperson. It doesn't come to a, a, a uh, intern. It comes directly to me, and I'll answer it usually within the next 24 to 48 hours, but most of the time within the next hour or two, okay? So uh, I try to answer as quickly as possible. So if you're talking about trade support, yes, that goes directly to me, okay? Good question. Um, let me see, any other, someone is asking they had the same question. Uh, how long does this offer last? Well, like I said, this is uh, a pro trader strategies department. Uh, on average, most of these last a week because uh, I give these webinars every week on a different product, on a different course. And these will last roughly until the next product uh, webinar we give. And then we go into that special. So uh, if you're going to take advantage of this, I would watch this video. You're gonna, each going to get a video of this tonight. Watch it. And if you're really serious about taking your trading to the next level and taking advantage of these, Remember, we just shared with you a couple of examples, those last examples that you could have taken advantage of in the last week. You know, they took advantage of 55 points in like five days or six days. So these are things you could have, uh, if we had done this webinar a month ago and you decided to come on board and take in the course, you could have taken advantage of, but there are many more that will be generated within the following weeks and months. So uh, you just need the PTSX team in order to take advantage of those big moves, okay? Okay, good questions. If there are no further questions, this brings us to the end. Let me just see if there's one last question here. Uh, okay, I just wanted to tell you that your system is really showing the way in the market, thanks. Oh, you're more than welcome. Thank you so much. This is a student of mine, a very good student, and I'm glad it's helping you. And yes, that's our only goal. Remember, as an educator, we're just simply trying to educate traders. That, that's our philosophy. You know, there's so many webinars that you go to and they, they give you this sense of, uh, you know, a fear that if you don't do this, you'll lose. And, uh, you know, it's just you have to follow what they say and take their signals. But really what you're doing when you trade that way is you're taking yourself out of the game and you're basically letting someone make your decisions for you. And that's why most traders fail. All we're trying to do as educators is, as this uh, uh, student is saying, is just point the way of what the market's doing. And then we just jump on board. So that's what we're trying to do. That's the secret to success, to longevity, is to listen to the market, find out what it wants to do, and then jump on board. And that's the basis for everything we teach. Because ultimately, it's about you making your trading decisions, not us, okay? Thank you so much for that kind uh, comment. And listen, we are at the end of the presentation. I just want to say thank you so much for attending today. I hope you learned something. I hope you really want to take advantage of these big moves with this secret process and most uh, importantly, as we take one last look at our disclaimer, I look forward to all of you becoming students of mine in the PTST XT course. Thank you so much for attending today. Have a great Wednesday, and I wish you the best of luck trading. Thank you so much. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.